Hey everyone, it's Mel Rose back with another LuLaRoe styling tip for your Carly. I get asked all the time how to just tie a basic knot. So that's what I'm going to show you is just taking a piece at the bottom and you can take as much fabric as you want, bring it around your hand and just tie a simple knot. And that just gets some of that extra fabric up. If I'm down on the floor and I'm playing with my two year old and I keep getting my knees caught on my Carly, sometimes I'll take a bigger piece and I'll just make a big knot to get it out of the way. And it also gives it some shape. You can also tuck it up in the back and you can make that knot anywhere you want. It can be to the side, the front, you can even make a knot in the back, wherever you feel like you need to get that extra fabric away. Just make sure if you make a knot in the back that you don't put it in a really bad spot. Um, that's not gonna be very flattering. So if you do one back there, keep it down low and just maybe take a little knot in the back. You definitely don't wanna look like you have a tail, so you gotta keep that one down low. Um, another way, if you wanna make your knot a little bit more neat, is you're gonna take the side or wherever you want this knot to be, and you're gonna grab a big piece, so you've got a ponytail there, and then holding onto it with one hand, you're gonna twist it keep twisting it until you can't twist it anymore and it'll start to twist around itself. So then I'm gonna let go of that and I'm gonna let it just keep twisting and bring it around into a circle. So we've got this little curly cue thing going there and I'm gonna keep twisting that and bring it around the outside edge and I'm gonna tuck this through the middle. So tuck that through the middle, but I don't want that little piece of fabric sticking out. So I'm gonna take that and I'm just gonna wrap it right underneath. And then that is going to give me um, a neater, uh, just a prettier knot. Um, I like this look. Keep in mind the type of pattern that you're wearing. If your Carly has a seam in the back, this one does not, but if you look at your Carly's, you will notice some, if you can see that one, have a seam down the back and some do not. If you have a seam down the back, make sure that you're not pulling so much that your seam is going crooked. Also keep in mind the type of pattern you're wearing. So this is a vertical pattern. So these lines are starting to pull this way. That can start to look sloppy. So maybe don't make the knot as tight if you have lines going horizontally or vertically and keep it a little bit looser and keep it looking neat. That is your Carly hack for the day. Please subscribe to LuLaRoe with Melrose and join my VIP Facebook page if you're not on there and come shop with me. You guys have a great night.